Our top focus story this morning, 15 people were safely rescued from the floating restaurant boat which capsized near the Bandra Wali ceiling in Mumbai. Local people helped in the rescue operations. No casualties have been reported in this incident. Richa now joins me on the phone line with further updates on this. Uh, Richa, while the local uh, people in fact have been of a great aid in the entire rescue operations, what is the next progress there from the police, especially to find out whether there were any kind of negligence that were found to be on board? What is the reason for this uh, floating restaurant to capsize? Yes, absolutely, Aburva. In fact, uh, the eyewitness account as well as the employees who work there uh, they have, in fact, gone on record and stated that the ship started drifting backwards around afternoon. And, in fact, there were motorists who were driving on the Bandra Worley ceiling, noticed that the ship was sinking and informed the fire brigade and police about it. And, in fact, the, uh, the fire chief fire brigade officers as well stated that they looked into the CCTV footage to confirm if the ship was really sinking or not. And they didn't even know that this was a floating restaurant that they were looking at. And around uh, 6 to 7 p.m. in the evening is when the ship completely capsized, while some of the crew members, uh, in fact, were also there. And they were, in fact, safely uh, moved out of this Arc Deck uh, restaurant, which is a very famous, in fact, floating restaurant uh, uh, on the Barra Verde ceiling. Okay. Although, the, although the official word from the owner of this uh, uh, Arc Deck bar has been that they do not wish to comment on it, but uh, uh, they were... but. But the official, that, that is the fire official, has stated that, that there were only about uh, seven crew members that were on board, apart from uh, also the people who work on it. And uh, uh, in fact, uh, the police have gone on record and stated the DCP of that region that they have only taken the complaint of the captain of the ship uh, and the statement has been taken. But at this point, uh, they haven't filed an FIR because they are waiting for an official word to come from the ship owners or the people who work there themselves. But Richard, more importantly, there are questions being raised on whether this was being monitored closely. But at the same time, uh, how long was this floating restaurant really functional? Were there precautions that were being taken? But more importantly, how long was this restaurant functional? Yes, in fact, very interestingly, Apurva, this was the last day before the monsoon really hit Mumbai that the restaurant was in fact working. And they were in fact planning to shut it down, uh, uh, the restaurant bar uh, today, yesterday evening. And But this unfortunate incident uh, also occurred. But it seems like the owners themselves are not seeing this as a very big incident. Uh, although the police uh, might further investigate the Coast Guard also might investigate to find out if there were any irregularities or if the quality of the ship was not up to the mark. But clearly all that will only be revealed if an official FIR or a police complaint is filed with the Bandra police. All right, Richa, many thanks for getting us those details there. Uh, this was, in fact, a floating restaurant, Floatel, in which 15 people were rescued. The entire restaurant was called the Arc Deck Bar, which is a luxurious offshore dining and party attraction there uh, at, in the Bandra Valley ceiling. And that capsized uh, yesterday at around 6.20. That was the call that was received. And around 15 people were rescued after a yacht that was converted into a floating restaurant capsized in the Arabian Sea, after which uh, the, they, were, they were rescued with the help of locals as well. Currently, as uh, my colleague Richa was also pointing out, the reason for uh, this incident is also being probed as far as the other issues regarding permission and other illegalities are also being looked into this matter.